Hello everybody, welcome back to Sumatra on Bass. This week I had the opportunity to set up this Music Man Stingray 5. This is a 1999 model and somewhere back in that time when I was checking these out I was told by somebody in the store that this bass is a 35 inch scale which is why it has such a really nice tight sounding B string and uh, I didn't bother to question that. Of course they're actually 34 inch scale <laughs> so, so all these years I've been running around thinking they're 35 inch scale for the 5 string. This one has the bridge without the mutes and the diff uh, it has the three band EQ and the difference is they have this switch, a three way switch which affects the um, configuration of the coils in the pickup. So I thought I'd just do a, a quick blast on it to show you what those coil configurations are capable of. So as far as I understand these run from the position closer towards the neck is a series position of the coils, the two coils. The middle one is a single coil which is the one closer to the bridge and I believe there's a dummy coil under there to make it hum cancelling and the one closest to the bridge is the uh, two coils in parallel which is standard for a Music Man pickup. This is how they are normally wired. So we'll start I suppose from series and see what the difference in sound is. Now switching that over to the single coil position, which is the coil closest to the bridge. You can hear it's got more of that single coil bite, so let's have a play with that. So that gives you a bit more bite uh, as a single coil and in that last position here which is the standard music band pickup wiring of the two coils in parallel. You, you kind of get that, you get that brightness and a little bit of a mid scoop. So I suppose the series position sounds great for finger style. And then if you wanted that sort of mid-scooped and more top end, um, you'd go for the, for the parallel wiring. So let's have a listen to that. In contrast to that, let's try that same slap riff in uh, series mode. You've got quite a few choices there just between the three switch positions. And I think the three band EQ That three band EQ sure gives it a lot of range. So between the EQ and those three positions, you can get a lot of useful tones. And as far as the rest of the instrument, I mean, it's typical music man uh, fare. It's this, this has got that beautiful bird's eye maple uh, neck. It's an older one. I believe the newer ones have just a normal maple neck and the specials now have a roasted maple neck. Everything about it is very well executed. 
it's got the six bolt neck plate which holds that neck firmly. Uh, you've got a pop-up battery compartment. Um, everything feels solid. It, it certainly plays very nicely. Uh, it looks great. I love the black with the maple neck and I love the black knobs. They're a bit stealthy. So if you're in the market for a five string bass, you may want to consider the Music Man 5-string Stingray. It certainly uh, has very good build quality. It certainly has a great range of sounds. And as I said, this one is 20 years old, 21 years old. It's been well maintained and well looked after and it's still going strong. And we've actually not done any other work on this. The pots are, everything is original. The only thing we've changed on it is the strings. And uh, it just keeps going and going. So. Uh, very, very good workhorse five string. Uh, so thank you very much for spending this time with me. Really appreciate it. Keep making music, keep playing bass, be nice to each other. God bless and I'll see you guys soon.